Been told everything too. Hey, salt. You came over to steal our shit. Who the fuck are you taking us for? Didn't we fucking tell you, motherfucker, that all the shit here is ours, and you're dead if we catch you here again? Well, you fucking had it coming. Come out, you bitch. We'll open you up. Come 
Looks like it's that so. Shoot, please. I've no quarrel with you. Why did I sign up for this?
All right. The slaves from the West Canyon are finally at the ship. That would be the last of them. Tristan, you get them. Select the ones good enough to sell to the south and put them on the special training regiment. And this time, make sure the boys from the south don't complain we're sending half-dead shit. You got me? As you were, everyone. The Baron has spoken. Artyom, we took a look around. The main gate is guarded by a skeleton crew. You cannot go through gate. Go through the prison cellar where the Munai Bailer keep the slaves. Uh, <laughs> yes. In any case, the plan is this. Gul and I will try to take their guards down quietly and get in through the gate. If quiet does not work out, we will at least distract them, while you get in through the underground. Let's go. We'll, we'll walk with you. Don't lag behind. I have a favor to ask. If possible, don't kill the slaves. They're not... They just obey. The Manai by Lair. Obey the Baron. You're afraid, that's all. Gul is right about the locals. Here. This place. They're just kids, and all have been under brainwashing for ages. So we probably should take pity on them. So, a great? Well, let's do this. All right, I'll raise it and you get through. Come on! Great. See you up there. No use. Nobody go, nobody go. We stand here, all day here. You suck. Better go hunt, find some food, make slave, more use that way. You said right, completely, very right. <laughs> Come to kill. He's come to kill. 
Shoot, please don't shoot. Just what we need. Um, there is also bad news. The gate is locked and we can't take it out. Colonel, sir, Tamir here. We have secured the tank, but encountered uh, a problem with the gate. Copy that. We're going with plan B then. Act accordingly. Gentlemen. Surely you're not seriously intending to attack our fortress. I do respect your courage, but simply throwing your lives away, it's such a waste. Who is in charge between you two? Come up here. We have things to discuss. Just you listen to that bastard talk. A complete about-face. And we did throw a wretched into his plans big time. Point the gun down and come up. Otherwise, we'll have a pointless bloodbath on our hands.
and just get to the next floor. There's too many of them to count. Oh, 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 why the fuck does it rain so long? You must be one of the Just you take a fucking look at the beauty of the world. Fix it, I'll show you. 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 Well, you just fucking pull it. Put your back into it. Why the fuck did we feed you yesterday? Yeah, I'm sorry, master. I'm your slave. It was not on purpose. Water. Go give her a lesson. Forgive now. me, Uli Mirsa. I... You're a dog! Shut the fuck Why up! Why is that dog? The water is for people! For the master! Do you get it? Thank you. Come on, up the ladder with you. The boss only it's has one of those you. new arrivals. Come to me, the boss. The What's the matter with you? Look alive! Hey, pretty boy. Did you come from afar? You're the one to see the boss? Come on in. Don't waste boss time here. Just doing my best to introduce a little order into it. Without which there is no hope for something better in the future. But with no hope, you can't live. But let us cut to the chase. You definitely did not come here to enjoy the scenery. Ergo, you have a goal. And that goal is probably far from here. I respect people with their purpose in life, so I am ready to provide you with fuel for your journey. I'm not asking for much in return. Surrender Gyul to me. Bring her to me, and we all win. I have Gyul, you will have your fuel. Everyone gets to live long and prosper. Now what? Fuel herself has come for you! You'll answer for everything! He walked it! From the other side! That coward! Do you think I'm a fool? You didn't want to see it! Now you will all die! Starting with you, Gyo! Kill them! Artyom, get ready. We must kill these dogs! What is there? This is for you, dirty Ready? worm! <laughs> Tomorrow, but the world lives by deep. 
friend rules. The strong ones always win. Our strength lies in our unity. Our faith that keeps our flocks together. It is through this faith that we protect them, direct them, keep them from disappearing in this desert. But you, Gjul, you are leading our flock astray. They see you as something of a tiger. There is this aura of rebellion about you. The attraction of forbidden. It is an aura of problems nobody needs. Luckily, your death will dispel it. Why doesn't he speak anymore? Artyom, I'll go in before that dog runs away. I'll catch him and open the door for you. Hold on. Where are you going, you windbag? There you are! Bite a bullet! Carnage, you went all out here, didn't you? Whoa! Oh, impressive! So, this is the plan Gul was talking about. Keep 
open. Hooking the tech up. You gave my people hope. I'll never forget it. But this war has only started for me, and I must see it to the end. The winning end. Artyom, your dream led us here, but it won't help my people. This war is mine now, too. Go, Artyom. Follow your dream. You're back, my love. I was so worried. Coughing. We've left those sands long ago, and it still persists. <clears throat> what does Crest even smoke? <laughs> it's terrible. In any case, I'm better now. I hate to interrupt, guys, but uh, you should come to the mess hall. The table is almost served. Thanks, Stepan. We'll be there in a moment. Shall we go, Artyom? Or shall we stay a little longer? It's so nice. You know, Artyom, I've been looking at Stepan and Katya, you and me, and thinking how lucky we are. It was so different with my parents. It was bad. Go, Artyom. I'll rest some more and join you later. Everything is perfect, Artyom. Follow us. Seen them dance. Don't you worry. You get another chance. A moment of your attention, please. Half a year on the road, and four thousand clicks behind us. We have been through a lot. Duke, Damir. All right, people. I do understand I can't keep it a secret much longer. And after a careful study of the satellite maps we've obtained, <laughs> and much deliberation, we've found a place we could call our new home. <coughs> it is a river valley. There's forest and a hydroelectric power plant. Yeah. This place is quite far from densely populated areas, which, as our journey has proven, is important. We're about two days away from it now. So, Congratulations, yeah, everyone! Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah! Yet, uh, this is not our last order of business <laughs> for today. Stepan, Katya. Oh, Prince! Stepan, Katya, repeat after me. I take you to be my spouse. I take you to, to be, be my spouse. spouse. And vow to hold you from this day forward. And vow to hold better or from this day for worse, for better or for worse. For richer, <coughs> for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness, in sickness and, and in health. health. To love and to cherish, to love and until, to cherish death until death do us part. To us part. part.
As the captain of this ship, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Live long and be happy. Oh, and Gorka! 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 Oh! Anna, what's happening? Be careful, people! Anna, please hold on. What's happening? What is it, Anna? What's that cough? Gotcha. Do something. Please! Don't this can't be her. good. Give her air. Damn! I'm sorry, I didn't say anything. What are you talking about, baby? In the Yamantau, when they dragged me away, <laughs> that ghoul doctor said my lungs were falling apart. The gas I breathed in that ammo dump said I How don't have lungs. How can you love. believe that monster? We've just been through a desert and all that sand, so that might be the reason. Katya, Artem, a few words. Go. I'm fine now. I don't know about this. The old man is furious. So, son, care to tell me what Arno, do we do please. now? Let us not panic and think constructively. So, Katya, what do you think? I think that trusting some degenerate's diagnosis wouldn't be wise. A move from humid metro into the desert with its dry heat and sandstorms is a stress for us. Yes, I do think she'd be hit really bad right off the start had it My been thoughts gas. exactly. Thus, first I'll check her condition to the best of my knowledge. Also, we're approaching the valley with its forest air. That alone could heal her. I'm sorry to intervene, but did something happen? Oh, Anna coughed out some blood. Oh my god. Do you really think it's the same? Sounds more like TB to me, that's for sure. TB we can handle. We've got enough antibiotics, and air does help with that. And what if... What if that degenerate was right, Katya? What do we do? Is there a medicine? There was an air defense battery station in our village. Right on the brink of war, they received a new drug. It saved a lot of people after gas exposure and general poisoning. I'll check my mom's records and find its name. I think it was produced in Novosibirsk. Right, Novosibirsk. Yermak, your opinion. For Anna's sake, I'd go to the edges of the earth. As for Novosibirsk, it's about 2,000 leagues. Then it's decided. We head for the valley. If it is suitable, we settle there. If Anna's state worsens, I'll take a group of volunteers to find that drug. So Katya, please, find that name for I'll us. I'll find it. Don't worry. One more thing, Artyom. I want no surprises in that valley. You are our most seasoned scout. So take the rail car, one volunteer, and go check everything out before we arrive. Let's go back for now. Tell Anna and the people to calm down. <laughs> <laughs>